It was nice to see this clip. Uh, this is from Fox News. Uh, Marco Rubio, who's my senator right here, and I've, I've done some events with uh, Senator Rubio. I, li I like him a lot. We've had him on the show a bunch of times. Uh, but he doesn't get much national fanfare these days. I think he's kind of laying, he's been laying a little bit low for, for one reason or another. Um, but he did get on Fox, and I think he made a, a, a completely clear and cogent point about what is going on here. You know, we showed you the video from two or three days ago at the White House. They had this dude who, who is in women's body, plastic boobs and the whole thing, running around topless. And uh, Marco Ruby addressed that and connected it to uh, some other things happening in the world right now. We can, we can undertake a cultural hysteria, a ridiculous cultural hysteria that plays out. We had a lady or a man uh, that now claims to be a lady, you know, going topless at the White House two days ago at a, at a pride celebration thing. I mean, we can do whatever we want. We can be as decadent as we want in our society and our culture. We can break our politics. We can take our institution and weaponize them for political purposes on both sides. You think this ends here? The next Republican president is going to be under tremendous pressure to bring charges and indict Joe Biden, his family, his crackhead son, whoever. The pressure is going to be extraordinary. They're going to turn us into, so we're, we're decadent and we're in decline because we are, we thought we could do anything we wanted with our economy. We could send our jobs in factories overseas, break our politics, break our culture, break our society. We don't need parents. We don't need neighborhood. We don't need family anymore. All these crazy ideas. And now reality's catching up and it's hurting us badly. And today is frankly just a symptom of a much bigger problem, which we talk about here. And that is we no longer live in that world. He's right. We thought we could do anything we want, right? And he's connecting that to, we thought we could do anything we want. We thought boys could be girls. We thought we could do anything we want. We thought we could print money endlessly. We thought we could do anything we want. We could have military adventures all over the world. Now reality is setting in and we're looking around and going, boy, people are depressed. Boy, our economy is crashing. Boy, we're in wars that make no sense. We've got dudes in chick outfits showing their tits. <laughs> Can we just get demonetized? Can you say tits? I should have said boobs. I should Boobs is not going to get you demonetized. Tits, it's 50-50. Anyway, it doesn't matter. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Um, the point of all of this, guys, is that some people want to fight, and the people that want to fight, whether they're Ron DeSantis, whether they're Kevin O'Leary, whether in this case they're Marco Rubio, whether it's you or me, like, we must fight together.